Hey everyone, today we'll be doing another lead code problem. 771 joules and stones. This is an easy one. You are given a string joules representing the type of stones that are joules and stones representing uh, stones you have. Each character in stone is a type of stone you have. You want to know how many stones you have are joules. So letters are case sensitive. And if we have joules and stones here, you can see that uh, in joules I have two type of joules A and A capital and now the stones I have are A, A two A capitals and four B's so I will check that if this A is, is in the joules yes it is so I have one stone that is a joule now I have again in the next you can say indexes or in the next pair I have A capital which is also a joule and if I add all of them up, I am having total three joules. These bees are also present present in my stones, but I do not have these bees in the joules, so I will not be adding them. These bees are just not, you can say, the joules. The stone I have, but they are not the joules. So here, the capital Z's I have are the stones, but these stones I have are not the joules. So the joule is Z if they were if they were in smaller case. In the lower case, then we are going to return two, uh, two here, but we are going to return zero because there are no stones that are joules. Here I have three, like I said before, here I have three, this capital, uh, these two capital A's and this one that are stones, so will be uh, that are joules, so we'll be returning the total output. And that's it. So we're making a total output, we'll be starting from zero, obviously, and four every stone I have so for stone in stones I have if that stone is also present in joule we are going to increment our total and then just return it that was this is very easy one so if the stone we have is in our joule we are going to increment our total by one and just return the total total that's it 